Welcome back everybody. The clouds, the snow beginning to break up here just a little bit. You can see the high woods uh, after getting a nice amount of snow uh, in the high woods and around the little belts as well. Uh, so uh, some snow, light and fluffy out there. That's about to change though, uh, the snow that is, uh, as uh, things are going to get a little sloppy. Uh, with warmer temperatures and wind moving in. Crazy eight right now in Great Falls. And it feels like wind chills are back down below zero, six below zero in Great Falls. So the snow also coming to an end uh, for the most part around the Helena area. And temperatures have been sliding down all day long. Right now we're down to 17 with a wind chill of eight. Current readings, a uh, couple single digits out there. Cup Bank at eight degrees as well. Most of the states uh, in the double digits above zero but a few locations now north central Montana closer to the high line with a wind chill back below zero and because of the possibility that wind chill values will get down to about 30 below closer to the Canadian border and uh, right along uh, the Milk River Valley there near Haver through Chinook and Harlem uh, we've got that wind chill advisory going into tomorrow morning uh, still for the Deep Creek Pass area a winter weather advisory for another few hours and uh, down towards the south here, uh, we've got an avalanche warning for the mountains of uh, Madison and Gallatin counties. Avalanche is human caused, but also just natural. The weight of the snow is uh, separating and natural slides are occurring and uh, big enough slides where, yeah, life threatening conditions uh, likely with uh, those avalanches unsurvivable avalanches uh, to be more exact in that area. So uh, keep that in mind. Stay in bounds, please. On the radar, you can see a little in the way of uh, some flakes of snow still out there. Again, the radar doesn't necessarily pick up uh, snow at all the best here in uh, the winter. We could see some flakes still out there, potentially in between the little belts and the big snowies. Look at some of that snow and ice once again all the way down south. Winter storm warnings from New York City all the way down into parts of Texas. Now back to the turtles that everybody has been asking me about. Well, uh, this uh, photo from the Texas game warden and yes, uh, those are turtles and they are stunned because of the very cold water temperatures along the Gulf of Mexico. When the water drops to uh, less than 50 degrees, uh, the turtles kind of get into a little shell shock, so to speak. And um, the Texas game wardens are out there picking up the turtles and saving them and we'll put them back in the water when the temperatures do come up, which they will in a couple of days back there in Texas. But here in Montana, the snow moving out, sunshine tomorrow, some clouds moving in late, some mountain snow, mainly mountain snow Thursday night into Friday, a few more snow showers, mainly in the mountains here on Saturday. Uh, but what you don't see is the wind really increasing Saturday and Sunday into Monday and Tuesday as well. Monday could be a little messy with a little mix of some rain and snow. There could be a little snow coming through parts of the state Tuesday and Wednesday as well, but uh, snowfall accumulations pretty much over with here for tonight. There will be a few inches in the western southern mountains here as we go through the course of Friday and Saturday and then Monday and Tuesday of next week, maybe a little in the way of some snow. Here's the forecast for tonight. Another chilly night with a lot of uh, northern Montana down below zero central areas down near zero. Uh, like around Helena and Great Falls and also around the Lewistown area for tomorrow. A sunny start, a chilly start. Highs in the 20s to about 30 degrees. The wind will be increasing off of the Rocky Mountain front for Friday. 30s and 40s. Some snow showers, maybe even down around Helena, but mostly in the mountains. Saturday, a couple of mountain snow showers moving through. Once again, windy, blowing snow, sloppy, messy snow as the temperatures come up here. So enjoy that serene snow out there right now. And Sunday, look at those temperatures well up into the 40s with some really strong wind, maybe gusts higher than 50 miles per hour for northern Montana on Sunday. Hell on a seven day forecast, 40s, even maybe 50 on Monday. I know that looks like a lot of precipitation, but there will not be a big accumulation of snow anytime soon. For Great Falls, it's more about the wind creating some uh, dangerous travel conditions over the north central part of the state through the weekend. All right, thanks, Curtis.